type thing a mini haul for you guys that I'll just whip it open real quick and show you what I got so let's go boom, 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 boom. more sale items from leftover from, from dead stock they're still got it's like their end of the year sale now there was like one day it was like a New Year's extra 10% off so I decided to get it and I think what they keep doing this, we're like, I put get an item and then they message me like a week later, or like last time it was a month later. And they're like, oh, it's actually not in stock, even though it said it was in stock and it's been it, like, I've even like checked after I bought it and it still said it was in stock. So like their customer service is so terrible too. Like I messaged them like multiple times within that month period, no answer for like a month. They still haven't answered me. Like it's so annoying. So really terrible customer service. Don't really recommend the website, but they have a lot of stuff. So that's, that's why they, that's what they got. You know, that's the, that's the situation. So first item I got is this beautiful, a uh, field out hat. And I've gotten, I've seen a lot of their products. They have a lot of really actually in interesting products. Um, it feels really nice. It's like very like gritty, like very like wooly, but like still like soft. Like I've never felt this kind of wooly material. Like it's like a cottony wool, not as much like wool, more like, or like it feels more wooly, but like more cut, like of a cot, like cotton feel though. Like it's weird how like wool is like softer. This is like a mix. It's kind of gritty, but then soft ish. So it's probably like get soft with wear kind of thing because that's what cotton is like a lot of time or just like canvas type materials um yeah they get soft throughout time this company makes up mostly just like outdoor products i think i purchased i think it, it was from them where i got this like little camping pot kit it was like 60 percent off from sense it was in one of my hauls and i think i have a piece of clothing from the no I forget there. I I swear I have something else from them, but maybe it's just the pots because I've just seen so much from them. Outdoor equipment equipment for rebels. I field out necessity before luxury, and it's got some random coordinates. Maybe that's like their headquarter coordinates or something. I don't know. Always check out. Hey, the coordinates are on here too. So yeah, maybe that's like their headquarters, or like the top of like Mount Everest or something. I don't know what what the heck these coordinates are. It's kind of cool though. I like. I definitely like nice tags. Like I was saying, it was only like. It was like 50% off and then an extra 10%, I think something like that. So it was like $30 or something with tax. So it was still like pretty pricey, but not bad for luxury. You know what I'm saying? Or necessity before luxury. So it's necessity, but I really like this patch too. And yeah, at the end of my videos, I always do close ups and previews. So make sure to check that out if you want to see the close up details. So yeah, it's got this beautiful split color, whatever you call it for black and dark green, forest green with this beautiful like pine green color for their logo. And I love the text for the logo too. Super nice, just really like this company so far and what I've seen from them. That's why I need to test out more of their products. A natural renewable and biodegradable fiber, wool is renowned not only for its warmth and comfort, but also for its unique resilience and strength. Made in the UK, so that's really cool. I didn't know it was made in the UK. This product was made in the UK by Craftsman using traditional methods and woolen yarns of high standard. So that's probably why it feels so nice because it's just really high standard wool. So I guess that's that explains it. If you look in here, I didn't know it was a it, voice crack. I didn't know it was like fully wool. Yeah, it says pure new wool. What the heck? This is gonna be like so warm. And then there's the tag on here. No price tag, just shows the field out. And then their little mountain logo. So it must be the coordinates for some mountain. I'm not sure. I'm gonna have to shoot the preview first before I actually rip it open. And then these I'll take out of the pack, but I'm also gonna shoot the preview before I try these on for you guys. I just got a random pair of socks to meet the shipping quota. So I was supposed to get a little ceramic bowl, which they're probably gonna message me and be like, oh, sorry, it's actually out of stock. So that's annoying, because I actually really wanted to try out this company that I've been seeing for so long called um, Frisbee Ceramics. I've seen their ceramics all over the place and they actually look really cool and funky. So I saw a cup, it was only like 16 bucks. So I was like, oh, and then I was like, damn it, I don't meet the free shipping. So I added these socks on to get free shipping, basically just to get the socks free. But now it screwed me because I don't even get the freaking 
ceramic that I mainly want. Oh well, here we've got some, I decided to try the Honor the Gift socks because I really love this company. They have, I have a blanket I got from them in one of my hauls and I actually love it. I use it all the time. You probably see it in a lot of my videos, just this nice throw blanket. It's a nice stitching, like, how, what, I don't know how you'd call it. It's like kind of like a reverse weave kind of thing. So you, it has a design on one side and another, another design on the other. Um, and it's like different colors and like colors on one side and then black and white. It's just a, a beautiful blanket. So I really love the company now. Just from that one blanket, I was like, damn, this is sick. So I need to try some other stuff out. And I was like, oh, okay. They got some socks. So we got an honor of the gift. I already like the package, already like the packaging with that just plain white mat, mate, mat, or mat, <laughs> not mate, mat, uh, logo of honor of the gift. So that's very nice. Then it's got the tag on the back, made in China, style iron piece, because I guess this like barbed wire kind of piece logo, which is co pretty cool. I just need, I just wanted some like black socks. I don't think I have very much black socks. One size, 85% cotton, the rest po 13 poly and 2% elastic. Right, so poly, polyester, better to have mostly cotton. So that's pretty sick. I thought on the website, it said 100% so cotton socks. That's so stupid too. Their website, I swear this company's customer service is terrible. So I thought they were 100% cotton. That's why I like specifically chose these ones. I was pick looking through them and picked these ones, but oh well. So I'll shoot a quick little preview for these and then I'll try the stuff on. Yeah. Oh yeah, there was some text in the, oh, it just says eight to 11 sizing. That's perfect size then. Not a very big size range. And then it has the honor of the gift on the bottom. I think it's like just stit, like it's actually like part of the material. So the logos will stay. So that's nice at least. And then black, not bad. Some different colors for my collection. That's what I need. And yeah, okay. Or is it just tight? It feels so scratchy. I've never had just a wool. I think the wool's kind of just like meant to shrink. Even my Patagonia hat kind of like was tiny on the head and I, it's kind of loosened up a little bit, but yeah, I think it loosens up over time. That's why they try and make it like much more like tighter and tiny, but it's just so tiny. I hope it does stretch. Yeah, look, it's already like stretching out just for me pulling on it a little bit. It's just very like itchy. I hope it softens out too. Cause that's why I didn't like wool. Cause it makes me smell bad and it's like itchy, but We'll have to see. I thought this was a cotton mix too. Let's see if the website lied. I'm gonna double check. Cause like, what the hell? Still so fire. Like I, I think it was just, I fell in love with the, the half and half. That's why like, I was like, I need this. This is the sickest design ever. Like I just, I never seen anything like this for a hat that is so fire with the color choice and everything. So I was like, you know what? Whatever. It is a bit tiny on my, on my head, but I have a tiny head anyway. So it kind of works out in the long run. You know what I'm saying? And now I uh, to put these socks on. Well, let's, oh my God. I just got fluff and everything in my nose. So much husky hair, Maya the Husky, Maya. Come see these socks. Okay, okay. Like how they package it. No stupid plastic thingies in it. Beautiful, um, two, two logos on the bottom of the foot just to make it last longer and they're not like wash like wipe off it's not a print it's actually like the stit in the stitching it's actually like part of the colored stitching so you can even see it through the other side so that's really nice to see and then let's toss them on my little clean little feet because i just had a shower not too long or like literally before shooting this probably gonna keep this stuff on too for my next video the re-up that i'm shooting um, why is this doing this? Okay. Nope, can still see the... Okay. Yeah, so I'll probably just keep this stuff on because it's pretty fresh, pretty fresh fit. I like to wear new stuff. Makes me feel happy and nice. Oh, these are soft too. These are nice. Good choice. And they're not too tight. They're nice and stretchy. That's They're actually really nice. I like these a lot. So... These will be a good black sock just to wear all the time. Don't have to worry about getting them ruined. Ruined. Ah, perfect. Really like these. Fire. There we go. And they're like half off also, like 10 bucks, I think. Had to get the free shipping. Yeah. Put it over here so I can show you the full fit. 
in action. Um, see, my age should come be in the video. You could have. Oh, yeah, I need, you need to show you the socks too. Okay. Boom, boom. Fire hat. Dope fit. Yeah, it's more like I just gotta push my hair back. A bit more. The socks. Fire. That's like just something nice. You don't have to worry about ruining them. They're just like already black. The logo won't wipe off. Fire fit. All right, thanks for watching everybody. Make sure to like and subscribe. Hopefully you enjoy these. That yeah, party. that's about it. Hey. Stuck in the product, I'm gonna have to weave this out to cut it out. Like, what the hell? It's so stupid. Don't do this. It even had a clip tag, and then for some reason they decided to pull a plastic tag, and they're like, no, this tag needs to stay on here forever.